Hello everyone. Today we're talking about smart homes and explore the privacy risks these devices pose. From your smart speakers to connected thermostats, our homes are filled with devices that know more about us than we may realize. First, the growing presence of smart devices. Smart home devices are becoming a staple in households worldwide. The convenience of smart assistants, security cameras and automated systems is hard to resist. But with this convenience comes a substantial risk to privacy. According to the US Government Accountability Office, the GEO, those devices can collect data like our daily routines, physical locations and even health details. With millions of devices in homes, the amount of sensitive data collected is unprecedented. And this trend shows no signs of slowing down. So what do our devices know about us? Let's look at some of the common data types collected by these devices. Smart speakers can listen for keywords even when not actively in use, capturing ambient conversations. Smart thermostats track when you're home or away based on temperature changes. Smart security cameras not only record video, but often upload it to cloud storage, sometimes with facial recognition capabilities. These devices collect and share data constantly. A study by MIT and the University of Virginia highlights that 89% of IoT devices communicate with external servers, which raises concerns about who else may access this data. Next, the privacy risks of smart homes. With data being collected and potentially shared, the privacy risks are substantial. First, there's the risk of unauthorized access. A recent report from the Electronic Frontier Foundation points out that manufacturers often don't prioritize strong encryption for IoT devices, which can make them easier for hackers to access. Another risk involves data monetization. Many companies use the information collected to build consumer profiles, target ads or sell insights to third parties without user awareness. A prime example might be uh, Alexa, which is obviously the same company as Amazon. The GEO report explains how this practice can lead to users being unknowingly tracked across devices and services, creating a digital footprint that companies use for targeted advertising. So despite these risks, many consumers unknowingly enable privacy-compromising settings. For example, many smart speakers have default settings that permit data collection for product improvement, quote-unquote. However, the agency ISACA notes that users can often adjust privacy settings but don't due to a lack of awareness. Another common pitfall is using weak or default passwords, which can make devices more vulnerable to hacking. The Federal Trade Commission and, of course, myself advise changing default passwords and enabling two-factor authentication on any device that supports it to reduce the risks of breaches. So how can you protect your privacy? First, start by reviewing privacy settings on each device. Many manufacturers offer options to limit data collection. Opt out of any data sharing options if possible. Next, use a separate network for IoT devices. Setting up a guest network keeps these devices isolated from your main internet connection, which can protect your primary devices in case of a security breach. Finally, consider using smart home devices that offer privacy protections, such as local data storage rather than cloud-based storage. So as we embrace the convenience of a smart home technology, it's crucial to remain vigilant about privacy. By understanding what data is collected and taking proactive steps to protect it, we can enjoy the benefits of a smart home while minimizing the risks. So if you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more privacy and security tips. Thanks for watching.